those aren't wet spots. This is actually, if you were to look at this from above, it's the globe. How cool is that? Right in the middle of this memorial. here. So let me ask you, what did you think of this? Overwhelming. It is overwhelming, isn't it? Absolutely. More so than I had anticipated. Oh yeah, nothing can really prepare you for the magnitude of this. No. Mag so I want to leave you a little bit ago that, you know, I thought I had finally Put Vietnam behind me. Yeah. Until yesterday at the wall. No. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I probably won't ever be able to put it all behind. You me. won't. You won't. What? No. You won't. We get uh, through it. You get through it, and you get through it together. That's right. We talk to a lot of people who say that they they didn't want to talk about their experiences or their fathers or grandfathers or brothers or. But then they come here and there's just something very um, healing mm -hmm. about coming here and about being around other people who understand what you've seen, what you've gone through. Luigi, I know you'll agree with that. Oh my goodness, look at that. Kilroy was here. <laughs> That's fantastic. So what do you think? What do you think about this memorial? Oh, this is, I, I wouldn't believe it if I wasn't here. It looks so different in person, yes, doesn't it? You yeah. see it in pictures and you don't get the full, no. you know, meaning of it. Oh, when yeah. And when you come here and you look at it and you you see it, it just really hits you right in the heart. It does. It's yeah. honoring everybody. Yeah. yeah. Virginia, North Carolina. Yes, everybody is honored. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. This gentleman, his name is Jones. Jones is going to be one of our police escorts and uh, he's on the motorcycle and then I'm going to go find Rosie the Riveter for you. Bonnie Snyder is her name and she dresses up like this every single day. 